Hello, my name is Amul and in this video, I'm going to install Python 3.7.3 on my Windows, Microsoft Windows 10. But if you have Windows 7, 8, 8.1 and 10, you are good to go. So let's go ahead and download it first. So launch your preferred browser i have my sorry uh, google chrome and go ahead and pull up this website www.python.org and then hit on this downloads button you can simply click on this button the yellow download button or you can just click this one it's going to be okay but if you just scroll down you can go ahead and install from here as well so this was just released on 25th of march 2019 and today it's 28th so i'm going to click on here download this is going to give you another page here uh, if you just scroll down you will get the files section here and you have two options you can get the 32 bit or the 64 bit and you've got executable installer and web based installer as well so he here is the portable one so if you want to download on this computer and take it to the other one you can do this one for mac user you simply have 64 bit you also have 32 bit installer as well so I'm going to use a web based installer here for my 64 bit operating system. So I'm going to click on this one and it's going to be saved because I'm using Google Chrome. It will be saved here on the desktop and I will have this link to click on. Once it's downloaded, you can simply go ahead right click or just click on this or open or you can simply click on this link here very important thing you do not want to leave this unchecked so make sure you check this add python 3.7 to path so that you will be able to execute anything from command line or any application will be executed as soon as you uh, execute it from command line or any other python based software should run properly the other thing is with this installation you are already getting the pip at tcl the idle python test suite and pi launcher as well documentation can be unchecked and this is not going to take a lot of space on your disk hard drive now you can click on next or you can simply click on this install now button but because i do not need the documentation i'm going to uncheck it and hit next button and just install it yes and you can see this is 64 bit so that's what i wanted and it shouldn't take long time because i do not have the documentation being installed if you have any issues during installation you can simply leave the comment below I'm very happy to reply ASAP and it should be just okay now here we go because we checked the box the add to Python add Python to the path once it's installed, I would be able to run everything. 
I would be able to run Python command from the command line. Click close. Go ahead and launch Python uh, terminal. The command prompt and simply type Python. You've got 3.7.3. .3. So simply type to execute just few commands. You can type Python like print because this is going to be hello Python. Oh. And you can see it's working properly. One more thing a lot of people asked on my last video. Okay, I'm sorry, forget it. Here we go. So you can see I already have pip installed in few packages as well. So if you're wondering how to install the pip and the packages, it's very simple. You already have a lot of stuff here. You can see you've got pip, that's also a package, pits, and then setup tools virtually in V or Microsoft Windows. So this is how you install Python 3.7.3 .3 on Microsoft Windows operating system and you get pip installed with it so thank you so much for watching this video please like share and subscribe to my channel have a good day bye for now